Me and you, we do this every day, taking our trash out. That's where we think the journey ends. So what do we have here? Roughly half of this comes from the kitchen. Harmless? It's just a trash bag. This is what one trash bag does. Every year, 300,000 tons of waste are being dumped over here. Globally, the number is 2.4 billion tons of waste every year. So what does it mean to our Mother Earth? If we collect all the waste and dump it into truck, the chain of the trucks would encircle the whole world 24 times. When bio waste is mixed together with all the other kinds of waste, a toxic anaerobic process starts. They produce two of the most dangerous greenhouse gases, methane and carbon dioxide. Let's change this! Our solution can be found here, in this in-betweens of the urban environment. We have invented a model of a tiny urban garden which will turn the biosphere of this neighborhood into fertile soil. And guess what? It's led by children. They are the pioneers and they're the ones who will start this chain reaction for future generations. Children are also um, very curious naturally. They have the time and they have the enthusiasm to actually take care of their environment. Together with teachers, we will host fun and practical workshops where the children will be equipped with the skills of taking care of the garden. We all have our personal connection to this problem. I come from one of the most polluted countries in the world, Bangladesh. Every year, more than 100,000 people loses their battle of life against air pollution. When I was in Thailand, my school would give daily updates on PM particles. And some days, the officials would even close the schools because of the air pollution. Air pollution will most likely be the leading cause of death globally by 2050. We can't let this happen. Every school, every neighborhood, and every city can have their own urban garden. Join the movement!